Okay, this time I'm going to do a video on clothing for outdoor use and how you can save some money. Um, if you go into any camping shop these days, it's more like a fashion store than a camping shop. It's all brand names, over the top prices, um, totally unnecessary. This winter I bought this, which is a Heli Hansen base layer. It's supposed to be one of the best. I've had it about a year. Already the elastic's gone in the sleeves. There are threads coming out, where I've been running, my rucksack has rubbed it away. £23 that cost me. And it's no better than this, which was £3.99 on the market. Still made out of very similar materials, it wicks really well, it dries really quickly, it's warmer than the Heli Hansen. And that just works. £4, you can't go wrong can you? You can buy five for the same price as one of the Heli Hansons. And then it goes on. This is a packable jacket from Regatta. I mean, we'd all like to have a flash Gore-Tex pack light jacket, wouldn't we? £150. This weighs 300 grams, made by Regatta, as you can see. Comes with a stuff set. This cost me 15 quid. It's breathable. Got a hood. It works. For £15, you can't really go wrong. This is fine in the summer. Um, if you need something for the winter, you don't have to go over to like an expensive Berghaus jacket or North Face or anything like that. Get down to your army surplus. This US Army issue, three layer Gore-Tex. It's got lining in it, it's got a snow lock lining, it's got a lining in the hood. Your helmet will fit under there if you're a climber. Everything you could want really really strong something like this if it were in red with burger house label on it something like that 200 250 quid i'd have thought this cost me 60 pounds absolutely brilliant really tough really hard wearing matte pockets in there you name it can't go wrong even got a peak on it i have added a little bit of um wire inside so i've got a wired peak but apart from that I haven't had to do anything to it. Brilliant. You'll see I'm wearing a fleece. This is North Face, one of those micro fleeces. Thought it was alright, 35 quid, bit expensive. Went to TK Maxx, four pounds later, found something almost the same, only this is better because it's got a little beard guard so that the zip don't rub when you've got it done up tight. It's thicker than this, it's warmer than this, and for four pounds, it doesn't matter if I fall over and tear it, because I'll just go out and buy another one. Can't go wrong. What else have we got? To wear on your legs, Ron Hill Tracksters. Now these aren't expensive. I got two for t for twenty pounds, so it works out at ten pounds each. This is the classic, and I've used this in the summer, in the winter, use them on the bike, use them in the mountains. They're brilliant. There's really there's nothing else that you need. Just put your waterproof trousers over the top if it's raining. Jobs are good. If you don't like tight tights like that, then this sort of thing, which is your classic Crag Hopper Kiwi. Now, they want you to spend £45 on a pair like this. If you've got a local TK Maxx, that's where you'll get all of Crag Hopper's seconds and things like that. Pick these up. I saw them only this week, £14. You can't go wrong, especially if you're small or big, because that's the sizes they always seem to have. So it suits me, it suits suit the big guys as well. But they're awesome, and they're cheap. If you're while you're in the army surplus, have a little rummage around. I found this. It's a genuine Thermarest, 20 quid. You can't, you can't want more than that, can you? That's about, oh, that's not light, but it's really comfortable, worth having. And while we're on that, if I can find it, this is my sleeping bag, this is my summer weight one. Uh, the extreme rating of this is uh, zero degrees, but realistically it's more like five degrees. Um, of course you can layer all your cheap clothes on, put them on first before you get in this. Again, this is made by Gellert. Gellert isn't a big brand, it's not a Berghaus, it's not a North Face, nothing like that. It's not a Rab sleeping bag, so it's cheap. This cost me 20 quid, it weighs 800 grams, I've used it all over, brilliant for the summer, obviously 5 degrees is about as low as you'd want to go, 
Um, but yeah, for £20, 800 grams, you're not going to get an awful lot lighter. I mean, you can get these really, really expensive down bags, 600 grams maybe, but you're going to pay over £200 for them. It's pointless. Get one of those, maybe a silk liner. They're not very dear. Got yourself a good little system, a bit more adaptable too. Check out some of my other videos and I might be able to save you a bit more money.